Hello, and welcome. This one was recommended to me by a friend. I forgot. I forgot the dash option. How do I turn this off, please? Baby, no! <laughs> Air control! Let's turn it to max and see what happens! Yeah, I don't, I don't want that. I don't want that at all. Can I turn that off? Where's it at? Slide button, sprint. I mean, it's mostly this area where this is annoying. Now, you might notice this area is kind of small. And it is. Can I throw my hat? Another thing I could do. Now you may have noticed some slight graphical glitches. That's because this map is made by someone who doesn't know how to make a map. It's a sh sh shitty map design, I'll tell you that much. Come on, man. You're having bleed over. <laughs> look at that, look at that. Tell me that's good map design. It ain't, it ain't. That's just a whole bunch of garbage. But don't worry, the, the map will pick up eventually. Don't, don't, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. You might, um... You might have, might have some questions about uh, why the map is so shitty. I mean, where do we go? There's nowhere that we can logically travel to. <laughs> if you're a loser who adheres to Euclidean geometry, you might have that feeling. But what if we don't believe in Euclidean geometry? What if we open our minds? We can do anything. Oh look, there's that guy we just killed. I love this. Can I just say this is the best goddamn effect I've seen in my goddamn life? Goddamn, this is good. Get out, Sigrond. Thank you. Hey, hidey ho, motherfucker. God damn it, I wasn't done listening to that one song I was listening to. Oh, I'm such an idiot. Anyway. Well, this map is fantastic with the base weapon kit. <coughs> I kind of wanted to give High Noon another go, because I like High Noon. It's High Noon. It's just, it's just nice. And what do we do? We don't have a red key. What is a boy to do? Get on the ground! Oh, that's where we were. Hmm. Don't forget to pick up the herb. Delicious. Oh, hey, we're at the gallows. Oh, hey, we're back here. Oh, hey, we're at the gallows. Oh, hey, we're back here. Ain't that just goddamn magical? Um. Wait, what? Oh, my god. Oh, my god. That's impossible. I do like pasta, but I don't like things that are impossible. Uh, what do I do again? I think I'm supposed to go outside. There we are. <laughs> Get off, Sigrond. And give me your coins! Look at this. Look at this texturing technology. We have a sign on the ground. And it's floating. <gasps> every eye does that, by the way. Uh, every single eye in this map will close if you shoot it, but it doesn't serve any major function. It's just, it's just kind of like, hey, do you like, do you like closing eyes? I wonder how the enemy AI responds to this. I imagine not too good. I imagine they just kind of freak out when they have to deal with this shit. I'm 
sorry, what? It's also the only gun that can do that. God damn, mother clucker! doesn't know what to do anymore. Baby, no! Baby, please! Be strong! Baby, no. Baby, where are you? Hello? Hello? Whatever. When the man with a gun tells you to get on the ground. You get on the ground. And you're gonna pick this grape off the ground. I kinda wanna go up there. Yeah? Just to see what it's like up here. Are you fucking kidding me? This is awesome. Holy shit, my brain! That's me! That's me! I can't shoot myself, but that's me! Me? Where are you going? Hey, come on, wait up! What, what the hell are you doing? Get back here! God damn it. I keep, I keep being too fast. I can't believe I can't catch up to myself. I love this, by the way. Have I, have I told you that I love this effect because it makes me go go? I know what you fatties like. It involves lots of bullets. Oh no, I picked up Frank Sinatra. Cool. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, hello. <laughs> anyway, let's go through to the actual where we're supposed to be going right now. Let's go do the thing we came to do. He's watching the TV. Hello, Mr. TV. Do you like the TV? <laughs> Did I just snort? On Vanilla Doom, that's kind of scary to do, by the way. Yeah, there's, there's something about it just, just, just rustles my jimmies through. And I'm like, oh no! Oh no, I'm going to die. Sad day. Oh yeah, I remember where it is. <laughs> Open up, Buttercup. I've got places to go. Gun on the ground, dudes. Who benefit you and me both? 
This is actually kind of a tight area, ammo wise, on an old doom. By the way, there's a dog that says WOOF! And up there is, is a dude who has like a very opinionated opinion about things. I, I kind of like this. I don't know what to say. This is just freaking cute. Look at this. It's all like, it's gore. But it's actually just... It looks like how the Mockingbird died. It's this thing that's a duck. It's a duck! Quack, quack. Hello there, Kamada. Do you like cheese? Do you like onions? Do you like both at once? Well, if you don't, don't talk to me. I can't believe you talked to me. I told you not to talk to me, and you didn't know this information yet, but I'm going to judge you as if you should have. Oh, he's having... He's having a laugh. Doesn't matter you can slap him. <laughs> Give him the good old slaps. Chinese water, huh? <laughs> I'm getting better at Chinese. I'm, 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 so, I'm, I'm taking my, my studies a bit more diligently. The thing about Duolingo is you can't just do the assignments and expect it to work. You gotta put in the effort, man. You can't learn something if you don't try to learn something. I know that's not gonna be the answer most people want to get out of their stupid little uh, app, but... Trust me when I say this, man. You gotta put in the work or you ain't getting out the effort. But I also try to do little exercises outside of that to sort of keep my brain fresh. You know, it's gotta go like, hmm, how would I say that? How would I say X or Y in this language? It's a good way to keep your brain fresh. And it also integrates it into your vocabulary, which is the, the real thing about learning a language is integrating it into your vocabulary proper so that your brain can do the smarts. Now, this is a tough part. If I get this right. That's how this works, right? How do you get back up there, then? So let me explain what exactly is going on there. There are three secret switches that you somehow have to activate by going down those passages and then not going down those passages. I don't know exactly you're expected to do it, but... Which, fun fact, I didn't know the switches were there at first, so I took a long time figuring that one out. There's something going on over here. Oh no, that must be something else. Okay, whatever. I don't have forever to play today, but I want to play as much as I can. Don't 
Don't tell me you have to rocket jump this. You know what? Let's try this. Yeah, I can't do this. And I don't think rocket jumping in Doom works like that. Maybe you gotta go through them once. They have to do it again. And this is like the, oh, you did it, kind of thing. Bad, 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 bad! Let's give it a go! That's a robot face. And those are- that's a house! Why is everything something?! Yeah, I know this works. We'll, we'll do it anyway. We'll do it when we're done in this particular section of the map, but... Don't forget to fan the hammer, kids. Maybe I'll just call the quits for now. What's a reasonable weapon? Grenades. Listen, man, I understand your personal problems, but. Take a lot of big targets. Naturally, take a lot of damage from that. Okay. <laughs> oh, this is the. Oh, okay, you, these pools were filled with water when I originally came here, but they were filled because they were the pools that empty out into the other pool. You know what I kind of want to do? I want to make an. Uh, my, I want to make a, a summoner for. Pathfinder. That's the next. If I ever get the chance to play a character in Pathfinder, which I probably won't, um, I really want to play an I, uh, one of those uh, schmucks with my Eidolon. Because I just kind of like, I just kind of feel for the idea right now, you know. Also, ever since that goddamn uh, wad, you know what I'm talking about. Things have been weird. I don't, I don't, I don't have the... Fine, then. You get your wish. But that's where we end the episode. If you want to lodge a complaint, lodge it with the man who made the mod. And with me for not making saves! Like a dingus. Let's go take care of this arch though, so I don't have to worry about it. I, I, I'm used to his fire being more visible. Yeah, like, that didn't seem to happen. Hell if I know.
I get to see the pool in the suboptimal state of the end. This man, that's just like my opinion. My opinion is that more bullets are more good! Same opinion. Do you prefer more bullets, more good? Yeah, I think it's the fire effect of the staff that just makes it hard to tell what the hell's going on. I think that's actually the last thing we have to do here, really. I don't think we ever come back here. Um, actually there's one thing I remember we come back for. But that's not immediately relevant, now that I think about it. Uh, yeah, I don't know about how those, the secret things work, but, uh... If you have any idea, shoot me up, baby! I'm curious. I think all this stuff is because they're using an above layer. Let's, let's figure this out. I'm not using one of those now. 